morning guys this morning i'm attempting to change the purge valve on my 04 avalanche Let's see what size this other little thing, this other little screw is. Okay. Same size. <clears throat> Hopefully this will fit it. Yeah, it fits. Awesome. It's a little tight. <clears throat> I'm just getting it. I don't really have an extension that'll reach that, so I'm doing the best I can. Be nice to have a really long extension. There it goes. She's coming loose. There it comes. Man, that's a long one. Good lord. There in my tree. Pop that up. And of course it's raining. Be right back guys. Had to get my waterproof coat. Okay. So now I take this off. Okay, there's the electrical. Now for this. Somehow or another it's supposed to go like Alright, let's see here. This is what always takes me the longest time is these little pins like this. I have a hard time with them. See if I can figure this out. I'm up here, don't knock the phone over in the truck. Ouch. Okay, so. Okay, come on. There it goes. Please don't start pouring on me. <laughs> I don't need a wet booty butt. Awesome, in case if this thing's still recording, you push in on that clip. Awesome sauce. Oh, thank God. Whew. Lesson learned, you push in on the clip. So much easier. And there's the old one. One going in. Okay. Hopefully, that's got it. Power. Oh, 
don't need to lose that whenever I get this put in there. Okay, sit that right there. Ugh. And hopefully. This should take care of the engine code P0442 or P0446. Plus, if you're having issues um, with pumping gas and it keeps clicking, this is supposed to fix that. And just so y'all know, I got this off of Amazon for $18 versus the 60, 70 bucks at the auto parts store. Cause I gotta, I gotta try to save money, y'all. But. <sighs> Actually, that's not a good. That's not in there good. I don't think that's going to work. Uh, dang it. Come on now. Work for me, buddy. Hopefully they got it. I don't know. It feels a little loose. I'm not sure about that. But hopefully it'll work. We will see. Well, guys, as you see in the video, I got the part changed. I have took it down the road, tried it out. Everything seems to be running better than it was, which is great news. But I did learn a valuable lesson on the old one. There is a little rubber gasket, which I thought was actually part of the old one. But apparently it's a little rubber gasket that goes on. You just slide it off, stick it on the new one, and use that to create that vacuum seal and get a really good, strong connection. Just whatever you do, do not forget it because I did and didn't realize it till after I got back and as you'll see in the video the little white clip for the power strip for the power plug i didn't realize that my camera wasn't up good enough but if you push forward from the back of that that's right against the purge valve it unlocks it for you to slide it right off no problem so much easier well with that we love y'all remember to live life to the fullest you only have one chance at it and remember, enjoy the little things in life. They're the what they're that's what really matters in life. Sorry. <laughs> it's been a long day already. We love you and we're out.